Welcome back to the Star Spawn. I'm Captain Maleko. And this is you too. And we are doing a let's play of Blood Omen Legacy of Cain. And we just got done vortexing to poor people into oblivion. <laughs> well, especially, Don't worry, if you... especially the guy who was about to be raped in bed by the grave digger. <laughs> <laughs> Don't worry, if you just go back in, they're back, they're fine. They respawn? They do. They, everybody respawns infinitely. This is the greatest town ever. You don't have to worry about dying. <laughs> now, see, I'd be afraid of walking around in these hills because next thing you know, little roly polies and imps are going to pop out and go. <laughs> so I saw this door and I have no idea how to open it, so. I think it's something you had to backtrack, and I think this is a backtracky game. Right. That's why there's all those those fast travel points. I hate backtracky games. <sighs> and you know the music's actually really good. I'm I'm just listening. You know, I'm just listening to the music. It's it's actually one of the better soundtracks that I've heard in some games. The yeah. other sound effects in this game are atrocious. <laughs> 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 It's kind of like, oh, we're going to do this where everything that happens has got to make a sound. Everything. Every... If the wolf Didn't. farts, I want him going... Brrr. I guess they didn't invent the uh, the random... Stein okay, I'm not even going there. Stein Shackenrow. It's like Stein Shackenrow. Stein Shackenrow. There's some... There's some pillar like rocks there. Ah. I'll go back to the flat and save the implosions for later. Okay, this Alright, so Caves and towns, towns and caves. There's light coming from that cave. So sweet. It's Come good. drink from us. More blood for the sucking. That entire fountain. The rain will do you no harm. For our <laughs> So now rain rain doesn't hurt you anymore. <laughs> okay, so uh, you're right. That is that is why even have that then? It rained like <laughs> once in like the beginning for like two seconds. The thing was also like unavoidable. Like you would have to try to miss that. Okay, so putting the rain pointless. But does water hurt you though? Can you still get hit? Her I think water still hurts you. Yeah. Well, that would have been more convenient. That probably is an upgrade to nullify all water damage. <laughs> Big rock. Need the the red ring. What was in Zelda that you needed? The power gauntlet. The power gauntlet. So you can just the power glove. <laughs> The golden gauntlets. No, I think they're only go golden in uh, Ocarina of Time. Oh. Uh, I could be wrong. I'm sure someone will correct me. Oh, jeez. Oh, please. Help me, please. Oh, God. Here we go again. Oh, my God. Yeah. So I encountered this Minotaur thing, I didn't know how to get past it, so... I gave it a little whack with my sword, and then I said, oh well, oh yeah. I was more than eager to get the hell out of that cave as fast as possible. <laughs> no, can't go there? Okay, I'm gone. You, you know, with all these all these talking uh, uh, NCPs and all the sounds they make, it, it, it reminds me of Ultima 8 when all the Guardian does is taunt you every time you want to save your game. <laughs> every time you want to save your game. One is like every other time. At this very moment, Britannia burns. Britannia burns. Talk. 
Is that the sound of sweet sound of lamentation I hear? <laughs> All right, town number two. Oh, this is a castle. Yeah, it's like a castle town. Woohoo! With dudes in it. I want to murder your face in. The Big Horn Brothel. Indeed. Brothels and bars. Got flowers. That <laughs> Big Horn. Yeah. Big Horn. <laughs> Giggity. Looks the same bartender guy. And all the dudes. And look, he's still pacing with a naked picture of a woman behind him. He's like, mm-hmm. Yeah. And all the whores want to do in here is kill you, so... <laughs> oh my god! And they pull out their... <laughs> what? <laughs> what are you gonna say? Yeah, I don't know anymore. You know what? It's not even important. <laughs> it's just best if I just leave it alone. Uh, oh yeah, this place gets really interesting in the next room. And I mean really interesting. Like, what the fuck? Well, I, I see the blood there, um... Ooh, there's some blood <laughs> there, and... Oh, ho, ho! Finish her! Oh, please! Help me, kind sir! Nope, I'm leaving your asses, I'm out of here! <laughs> this is like... It's like the S&M Club. Bordello of Blood. <laughs> By the way, horrible movie. Don't nobody ever go watch that movie. Tales from the Crypt. Bordello of Blood. Stupid, stupid movie. <laughs> God. <laughs> uh, uh, uh. Everything you do in this game makes a sense. Now, see, I was going to say, now, this is reminiscent to Eternal Darkness, where everything you do makes some sort of wonky sound effect. You're right. <laughs> Didn't, like, every time you pick up an item, like, ha, 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 yeah. or something. Would a greater truth. <laughs> Wasn't it different for every character, too? I am... The bastards in Stention Crow shun me as Nozgov shuns them. What? I know what it means to be an outsider vampire. I fear you not, but remember this, there are others who will speak to you, so long as you know how to look. Brilliant. Greatest information. Thank you. What is your quest? You will know what to, you will find stuff if you know where to look. What is your favorite color? <laughs> what is the flying speed of a sparrow? <laughs> This guy, this guy, <laughs> he's trying, man, he's trying. She's your captain of the guard right there. <laughs> yeah. They don't follow you inside. They're like, oh, he went inside. Whoop, thank God. I'm just yeah, no worry, there's a lot of women Oh, my inside. God. They're everywhere in here. Okay, so, really? Th these women that... What the hell? Ballsiest people I've ever seen. <laughs> and that was it. The town of Stenshin Crow. Hey, I was right, Stenshin Crow. The aroma of its inhabitants. In life, I would not have graced the place with my presence. In death, I merely added to the stench. Get it, Stenshin Crow, Stench. Wah 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 wah. Oh God! Trying to add yep. humor to a game like this is just bad. Even with us doing it, it's bad. <laughs> Don't 
Wasser... Wasserbunden. I wish every game had a map like that, to be honest. No kidding. That is really good. Okay, so I'm listening to the music, and it just doesn't match up with Eastern European... European, you know, setting. I, I would this kind of music. You're thinking more like South America, like in the yeah, like, like it sounds like a like an ancient civilization, like Aztec or something. Yeah, or Incan. You know, I'm thinking Illusions of Gaia, not uh, the Transylvania. Purveyors of distrust and superstition. Oh God, not Most the gypsies. Most of their should be taken with a pinch of salt, since the gypsies often tinker with weary travelers' minds. However, a few gypsies have something interesting to say. I wish to be big. Oh, I'm sorry. Dude! This is the undest undestructible barrel. The competition! The steel barrel of doom. <laughs> Only great treasures lie inside such a barrel. Three gold coins. Everybody can shoot magic in this game. Holy crap! <laughs> Are you seriously trying to bring realism into this game? You, you just have to assume everybody can mutate and everybody can shoot magic out of their hands. They're daggers anyway. But they're making... What is he launching <laughs> them out of his... Is he a sniper? He's got a dagger launcher. <laughs> Freaking Mega Man over here... It sounds like a space door opening. Oh god, really? Come on now. Yeah, every single one of those purple tents were empty. But you don't know that unless you go in, so... You take the red tent. You stay in Wonderland. <laughs> and I'll show you how far oh, the rabbit hole traveling beneath a human, guys. The threat to my person is lessened, and much information can be gleaned. However, the illusion is flimsy, and any act of aggression on my part can break the spell. So now vampires can transform into normal-looking people. Oh no, you know, so now you won't get attacked by villagers. Right. That's a pretty good idea. Eventually, they'll just be able to walk through the, to the end of this game without any opposition. <laughs> and you'll just hang your sword up, and you'll just walk around going, "Hey, how's it going?" Next thing you know, he's at a beer. You know, he's at the pub drinking beer, and the game ends. Blood Woman, <laughs> Legacy of Cain. <laughs> But unfortunately you can't, because being a person drains your mana, and it drains it faster than anything else in the game. Oh, and you don't, you, you turn into like a, obviously a red-hooded men in tights, so, you stick out like a sore thumb. Vasabunt lay, its glory now stained and faded, a faithful child in the looming shadow of Nupraptor's retreat. Does this guy listen to himself when he's talking? <laughs> Holy crap! Speak English, you limey bastard! Oh, jeez. If I remember correctly, this is the town of all towns. The town to make every other town cry. Because <laughs> there's like 1,800 houses. All of them having at least one thing, just so... You felt you had to go in there. At times, my magic extends into very exotic disciplines, such as the manipulation of time. I am able to slow time down so I can move about quick as a wolf, while all others move as though they were mired in mud. Is, vampires can slow down time, too. Ah. What can't they do? That's really what I want to know. Can you speed <laughs> up this game so we can be done with it by now? Holy crap. Yeah, unfortunately. Fortunately, no. No, but fortunately, we are out of time. Yep. So, thank you, and uh, we will see you next time in episode six.